Hey everyone, welcome back to Joystick News. We've got some heavy news to share today. In a shocking and unexpected move, the indie game studio possibility space has been shut down by its CEO, Jeff Strain. Just recently, Strain announced that possibility space is closing its doors. The reason? He blamed the closure on employees leaking information about a major upcoming title, codenamed Project Vonnegut, to the press. According to Strain, these leaks led to a significant loss of confidence from their publisher, which ultimately resulted in the cancellation of the project and the decision to shut down the studio entirely. Strain expressed his frustration and disappointment in an email to the staff where he mentioned that he was stunned to learn about the leak and its repercussions. Possibility Space was known for pushing the boundaries of indie game development, creating innovative and compelling titles that resonated with the gaming community. Their unique approach and creative projects were highly anticipated, making this closure a significant loss for the industry. The leaked information about Project Vonnegut, a highly secretive and major title in development, was shared with Kotaku reporter Ethan Gatch. This breach of confidentiality not only damaged the relationship with their publisher, but also highlighted the fragile nature of trust within game development teams. It's always tough to see a creative team disband due to circumstances like this. The industry thrives on innovation and trust, and when that trust is broken, the repercussions can be severe. The closure of possibility space serves as a stark reminder of the importance of maintaining confidentiality and the impact leaks can have on game studios. What are your thoughts on this unexpected closure? Do you think the leaks were handled properly? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for tuning in to Joystick News. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for the latest updates in the gaming world. Stay strong, gamers, and we'll see you in the next video.